Hello everybody. I'm going to read a post from my Google Plus page. I'm continuing a post from my last video. Is YouTube video Ed Sheeran Castle on the Hill official video communicating that somebody with the name of Sean transported girls in a Chevy Avio to Hillary Clinton's home in New York is the Chevy Avio the exact same one that Makila drives presently. Does Avisi mean Avio in the Shakespearean translation? Are they communicating? Parentheses, Shakespearean style parentheses about Makila and her yellow Chevy Avio in YouTube video parentheses Avisi dash Lonely Together, Fort, Rita, Aura, parentheses, question mark. Is some of this information communicated in the Shakespearean translation that Makila's Chevy Avio was red and that they painted it yellow, question mark. Rita Aura sings a song with the words hit and run. Are they communicating Shakespearean style that Makila and her yellow, parentheses, red, question mark, parentheses, Chevy Avio was involved in a hit and run, and if so, when did Trump, John Brennan, Mueller, I lost my place. Give me a moment. Chevy Avio was involved in a hit and run, and if so, when did Trump, John Brennan, Mueller, Comey, Rosenberg, Charlie Crist, Clinton, and Chevrolet know about Makila and her Chevy Avio, and are they involved in a hate crime, and why did they not take the appropriate action at the appropriate time? If Makila was involved in a hit and run, who did she hit? Question mark. Are some of those, excuse me, are some of these videos communicating in the Shakespearean translation that Makila has a gun and or illegal drugs and or a badge inside the Chevy Avio? Are some of these videos, parentheses, Shakespearean style, parentheses, communicating the name Carlos and or Torres and or, excuse me, and connecting them with Makila. Are the two following YouTube videos trying in the Shakespearean translation to get Keith Carlos to murder Makila? I'm gonna scroll down so I can continue reading this post. Give me a moment. Number one, Elliot Golding, dash, something in the way you move, parentheses, directed by Emil Nava, by Ellie Golding Vivo, period. Number two, share and future duet in New Gap, campaign by the female. Please observe the YouTube video, Fallout Boys, dash, centuries, Parentheses, official video by Fallout Boys Vivo. Does the story of David and Goliath come to mind when watching this video? Are they communicating Sheriff Gautieri in the Shakespearean translation? Are, <coughs> excuse me, they communicating Farrell Decker with Fallout Boy? Are they communicating Charlie Crisp with centuries? Are they communicating that Charlie Chris, Farrell Decker, and Bob Gaultieri are involved in a conspiracy to nuke Emily Arena? Thank you, George. P.S. I retweeted a tweet on 9 20 17, dated 9 19 17, by the NYPD news titled Wanted for Assault because it shows two poles probably cemented to the path 
to prevent vehicles from driving past the poles. Is that correct? And if a vehicle runs into these poles, those poles aren't going anywhere. Is that correct? There are poles just like that on the cement between the front doors of the Gulfview Mall and the parking lot and the bus stop. The poles appear to be protecting anything and anybody on the mall side of the poles from vehicles. <coughs> the sheriff's office used to be right by the front doors of the mall. The problem is the poles are not attached to the cement walk at all. These poles can be moved completely and easily by somebody's hand. Thanks again, George. I'd like to comment on this post concerning the cement poles. The last time I checked, seems like there is a metal cover over the poles that make it appear that the poles are not connected on the cement. The cover of the poles do move. Thank you, George.